Hello everyone. In this video, I'm, I'll try to cover one important interview question. So the question is how to write the count of uppercase and lowercase letter in a string. So over here, I've taken one example to make you understand what is the question. So the question over here is, see, first see this, A is equal to Taj Mahal. So in Taj Mahal, T-A-J are in capital letters and M-A-H-A-L are in small letters. So I want the count of it. Okay. So the count for uppercase is 3. The count for lowercase is 5. Correct. Now how will you get that in SAS? Okay. So let me first get the uppercase letter. So let's say uppercase letter B capital. That is the variable name. I have kept a variable name as capital is equal to length i will tell you why i am using length i will use compress function here compress what is the uh, syntax for it compress string which is a comma we write the characters to be replaced i don't want to replace any character so i left it blank next we write the modifier so over here i can use the modifier l what is modifier l does modifier l will remove the lowercase letters from the string so it will remove mahl so what will be remaining only taj will be remaining now i want the count of that uppercase so to get the count i use your length okay so over here you can see see the count is three right taj so you got the count three now i want the small letters one okay so I will write variable name as small is equal to same length to get the count of it then compress then a which is the string I don't want to replace any character so I left it and I gave one more comma then here the modifier which I will use is u u removes your uppercase letters right so it will remove your taj so remaining is only mahal so Mahal is remaining and length will write the length of Mahal. What is the length of Mahal? 5. So you got it. Let me run now both. See, so there are 3 capital letters and 5 small letters, right? Over here, you can see L, it removes the lowercase letter from a string and U removes the uppercase letter from a string, okay? So this question was asked in a recent interview. I don't remember the company name. So everyone can just give a try for this. Please try it in your SAS studio to understand it better. And uh, yeah, that's it in this video. Please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned to my channel because I'll try to upload to one or two videos daily. And uh, I'll try my best to upload the teaching basics also and also to cover some scenario based interview questions. Thank you all.